Rabbit at the Wolves Party, an African-American tale from the southern United States. Well, the wolves got together. They decided they wanted to have a party. Oh, let's have a dancing party. We wolves love to dance, love to dance, love to dance, love to dance. We need a good musician to play for us. Let's see, who could it be? Sister Raccoon plays a mighty fine fiddle. We could ask her. And then somebody else, one of the wolves, said about Burr Rabbit and his banjo. Ooh. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Burr Rabbit starts playing and we will start dancing. And that's just what happens. Let's get Burr Rabbit. Oh yeah, great idea, great idea. We'll get Burr Rabbit. We can dance for a while and then eat him up. Perfect, perfect. Sister Wolf, why are you looking so worried about this great idea? And Sister Wolf said, I'm worried because Burr Rabbit is no dumb bunny. Burr Rabbit knows that wolves like to eat rabbits. So it's not like we can come over and say, hey, Burr Rabbit, want to come to our party so we can eat you? Burr Rabbit's not going to get near our party. Uh, oh, yes. Maybe he will. I just got an idea, said Sister Wolf. I got a great idea. You know how Burr Rabbit loves to hear people talk about him? He gets all puffed up. Flattery just works on that bunny. I know. I will bring Burr Rabbit back. Don't you all fret about it. You can just fix up the decorations for the party and I'll be bringing Burr Rabbit with his banjo ready for some fun and some eating. I'll see you later. And they said Sister Wolf, excellent. So Sister Wolf was feeling good now. Sister Wolf went over to Burr Rabbit's house. And in this story, Burr Rabbit's not in the briar patch. He's down in the hole, his home hole. And so she goes up on his porch and knocks on his door. And Burr Rabbit's down there playing a little banjo, as a matter of fact. And he looks out his window, out his curtain. He sees Sister Wolf up there on the porch. And he says, what? And he calls out, Sister Wolf, I'm not home. I'm not going to talk to any old wolf. Are you kidding? I've got banjo to play wolf at my door. Whoa. Sister Wolf said, sorry, I'll come back later. So Sister Wolf left. And about an hour later, she thought, well, maybe he's home by now. So she went over and she knocked on his door again. Her rabbit stopped playing banjo, looked out the window Sister Wolf, I told you, I'm not home. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'll come back later and when Burr Rabbit maybe will be home. That's a good idea. So she left again. And after another hour, she thought, well, maybe Burr Rabbit's home by now. So she went back and knocked on his door again. Burr Rabbit stopped playing banjo again. Look, what? What's wrong with this wolf? Sister Wolf, I told you I am not home. I won't be home till tomorrow. And she said, oh, okay. Well, now I know. She started to leave and then she, wait a minute. That was Burr Rabbit. That was Burr Rabbit talking to me. <laughs> not gonna tr trick me, no way. Not gonna fool me, trick me, fool me, trick me. No way, no way, no way. Knocking on the door again, yes I am. Sister Wolf, I told you, I will not be home until tomorrow. That's right, okay, you did say that, that's true, you did say that, but tomorrow is too late because we're having a party tonight. The wolves are having a party and they started thinking about the party and how this could be the best party that all the animals talked about for years because this would be the party that featured Burr Rabbit on the banjo, playing music for the wolves to dance. And everybody knows that Burr Rabbit starts playing music, that everyone starts dancing. 
even the trees pull up their roots and start dancing across the grass. The flowers dance, Burr Rabbit liked hearing that. Stuck his head out the window. Say more. Well, I was just saying if Burr Rabbit plays, the clouds start dancing across the sky. Birds start singing in harmony. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Rocks jump out of the creek to roll and roll and roll around. And click, clack, click, clack, click, clack some rhythm to that beautiful Burr Rabbit sound. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. And he came on out through the window and he said, Sister Wolf, tell me more, more and more. Please tell me more. I like to hear this. And she said, well, I thought you weren't home until tomorrow. Well, he said, sometimes tomorrow comes quick. You know that. Right now we'll say, well, tomorrow's today. How about that? How about that? She said, I like the sound of that very much. Tell me more about my plan. Well, I was just saying to everybody that the bees start buzzing. They buzz and buzz when they hear that beautiful banjo playing. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes, they do. And we all start dancing. The dirt jumps up and dances around. Rocks I already talked about. Everybody, 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 even the streams. And by then, she's walking along. And he's walking along right with her. And he has his banjo, of course, in his hand, because he always carried his banjo. Always. And they're walking along, and she's talking along, and he's saying, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. And she said, well, what do you think? And he said, well, you know, if everybody's already talking about this party, I don't want to disappoint, like, the whole world. So I guess I'll play for your party. I guess I will. I guess I will. And she said, thank you very much. They moved on. Uh, Sister Wolf, I noticed on the pathway here that there are a lot of like bunny prints and other footprints going towards your wolf's party. And I don't see any coming back this way or going off in another direction. And uh, what's going on with that? And she said, what's going on? Well, that's easy to explain. All the animals are coming to the party. All the animals. They all want to hear you play, Burr Rabbit. They all want to hear you play. Why would there be Prince coming back if they're waiting for you? Oh, right, of course. <laughs> that's excellent. Okay, let's get to this party and get it rocking and rolling. I'm ready to play. I'm ready to play. I'm ready to play some banjo. And so they got to the party. Burr Rabbit stepped in. Sister Wolf stepped in behind him and slammed the door shut and locked the door tight. Oh, one lock, two locks, three locks, four locks, five locks, six locks, seven locks. Whoa, that's a lot of locks, Sister Wolf. And she said, I know. Nobody wants to leave this party. It's too special. And Burr Rabbit said, that's just fine. Everybody's going to be dancing to some fine banjo playing. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. And Burr Rabbit looked around. Oh, uh, Sister Wolf, I think you said uh, all the animals are coming. I think I remember that uh, that term, all the animals are coming. Like, uh, I don't see, like, all the animals. I see wolf, 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 wolf like lots of wolves. And she said, oh, I, I guess I meant to say all the wolves. Oh, all the wolves and one bird rabbit. That's right. All we need is one, and you've got your banjo. And he said, oh, that's right. I've got my banjo. Well, I better start playing. Let's see him dance. Okay, you woes dancing. Let's see you dancing. Dance, 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 dance the night away. Come on, come on, woes. Do some dancing. Dancing, 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 dancing night away. And they started dancing. Because it was true, and it is true, that when Burr Rabbit plays the banjo, you just can't help but stomp your feet. You just can't help but romp around. Dancing, 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 dancing. Oh, yes. And Burr Rabbit is smiling and playing and smiling and playing and smiling and smiling and playing and saying. 
and this going great. She was telling me the truth, that's all they want. Some great banjo playing and some fine, fine dancing. And I'm doing the playing and they're doing the dancing. And everything's right with the world until Burr Rabbit happened to notice some of the wolves were humming and some of them were singing words which he couldn't really understand but after a while he got at least he thought he did it seemed the wolves were singing mm -mm, dessert yummy dessert bunny dessert yummy dessert uh oh yummy dessert bunny dessert yummy dessert oh the rest thinking uh oh yummy dessert Bunny dessert. That sounds a lot like me. Uh oh, uh oh. And look at all those locks on the door. And the window is shut too. And lots of wolves. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? And now I'm a tricky rabbit. I've gotten out a lot of fixes. What am I gonna do now? What am I gonna do now? Well, what do you think? What do you think? Well, if you've heard Burr Rabbit's stories, you know one thing for sure. Burr Rabbit gets out of this situation just like he always does. By doing a clever, clever trick. Doing a clever trick. But the thing is, I'm not sure what that trick was. Because, you see, the wolves won't even talk about this night. They act as if there was never a party in the first place. They're so embarrassed that Burr Rabbit got away. And Burr Rabbit, well, Burr Rabbit's Burr Rabbit, and Burr Rabbit tells his story different every time. One time, Burr Rabbit said, well, you know what I did? I started playing faster and faster and faster and faster and faster. And they're moving around and moving around and moving around and moving around. And then suddenly I stopped and I called out, I ate three wolves for breakfast, four wolves for lunch, and it's now almost supper time. All went running. Well, that's one way that ends. Another way he tells it is that he started playing faster, just like that early one, and he played really fast, 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 and they were, <laughs> and then he moved it into a, a little lullaby. Little wolfies go to sleep. Little wolfies go to sleep. Sleep, 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 little wolfy sleep, sleep. And they all fell asleep. And even with all those locks on the door, the rabbit got out. And sometimes he tells it, well, oh, Sister Wolf, emergency, emergency, I just broke a string, I just broke a string, emergency, emergency, let me hop back home and get another string. Because a five-string banjo with only four strings is not worth dancing to. You want to hear all five strings, all five strings, you don't want to hear four strings, four strings. What do you say? And she opened the door. Do you think he came back? No, no, no. And they're even more than that. In fact, you could probably think of some yourself that Burr Rabbit did. And then the story keeps growing just like that. And that's the story of Burr Rabbit at the Wolves Party. There you go.